welcome to another Caffeinated Entertainment video. This is Art here with you. This is my Spookathon TBR 2017. Spookathon is a readathon hosted in October by Books and Lala and um, her friends Shannon and Paige, both tubers, Shannon and Paige. Pardon me, I'm filming outside, changing location, so you might hear some background noise. Apologize for that. But uh, to repeat what I said, it's hosted by Books and Lala, Shannon Page. I'll have their channels linked in the description down below. But here is my plans for the TBR, for, for, for the readathon. First of all, I think I'm willing to do vlogs every day that week. The week is October 16th through October 22nd. And I'm going to do uh, a vlog every day that week. I don't know yet if I'm going to do daily uploads. Or if I'm just going to mash it together and do one massive upload at the end. I haven't decided that yet. I might do that so I can do it after it happens. Uh, that very well may, may be the case. Uh, so without further ado, let's get to the books. Let's get to the fun part, the books. Now there are five challenges for Spookathon, and I'm going to try to participate in all five of them. There's also a read-along book. Uh, it's a book by Cheryl Lapina. I'll find the cover and put it here. I forget what the title is. I'm not going to be reading that book. It, I have no interest in that book. Um, but the five books I will be reading, um, the first challenge is to read a book, read a book, read a thriller. Well, that's easy. The first thriller I'm going to read is Mr. Mercedes. I'll put it over here over my shoulder. Mr. B Mercedes by Stephen King. I've been wanting to read this for a long time. Perfect time to read it. Spookathon. October. Spooky book. Done. Second uh, challenge is to read a book with a scary word in the title. Now that scary word for me is going to be Anthony Horowitz's Magpie Murders. I've been wanting to read this book for a long time. So Murder is a scary book. Uh, murder is a scary word, uh, it's a scary concept of yourself or anyone else being murdered, so it fits along with that challenge just fine. Uh, it's actually one of the words she uses as an example, Books and Lala does, in her announcement video. Uh, another challenge is to read a book with a childhood fear in it. And for me, that'll be Stephen King's It. Now, I know this is a hawker, but I didn't like... I still don't really like clown, clowns freak me out. So, that's that. Clowns, no good. Nah. Weird makeup and face painting. No thanks. Not for me. Um, the fourth challenge is to read a book with orange on the cover. Now, for me, this is probably going to be Dark Matter by Blake Crouch. Um, because I have the paperback and it's got orange on the back cover, orange lettering on the front cover. So, there's plenty of orange and it's a book I want to read. I'm going to try my best to get to it. But that might be the challenge that I wait for last. Now, the last challenge, challenge number five, is to read a, a book with a spooky setting. And for me, that's going to be Joe, Nesmo, Joe Nesbo's Nemesis. It's the fourth Her Harry Hole novel. It's Inspector Harry Hole novels. I want to get the snowman so that when it comes to my theater, because uh, to my local theater, which I have a second run local theater in my area, uh, it gets movies about two, three months late. Uh, when snowman comes to When Snowman comes to that theater, I want to be able to watch it, having already read the book. So, reading Nemesis is on par with that. Those are the five books I intend to read during this week. I intend to also do Twitter things on Twitter, so follow me. My Twitter is always in the link down below. Follow me in Goodreads. Follow me anywhere and everywhere you can. Uh, 
And without further ado, I'm going to enjoy the rest of this beautiful day outside, and I'm going to actually get some reading done. So I'll see you next time. Happy reading, and see you soon.